What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are going to cover um, an issue that I had with one of my Minn Kota Talons on my recent family vacation up in a Thousand Islands on the St. Lawrence River. So, third season with both both of these 12-foot Minn Kota Talons. Never had a single issue with them. They've worked flawlessly. Love them. All of a sudden, we were up on the St. Lawrence River, and my port side or passenger side talon stopped working. So, what happened was, just to give you an idea of what I was dealing with, and then I'll show you what we did to fix it. All of a sudden, it literally just wouldn't extend all the way. The only part of the talon that would actually extend out of the, the housing itself is the fiberglass spike. No other part of the talon would come down out of the, out of the housing. So I jumped in the water. I, I thought maybe it was just stuck. Sometimes if you don't lubricate them often enough or clean them, they may get stuck, which you can just kind of jar them loose or pull them loose. Couldn't do it. It wouldn't come, it wouldn't come down all the way um, past that fiberglass spike. Again, that was the only part that would come out of the talon. So couldn't figure it out on vacation, waited till we got back home, got it in the garage here, and uh, we lowered it on the back deck with the tilt bracket that we have on there, and I was able to find out what the problem was, and it ended up being a very simple fix. So I'm going to show you guys what it was, just so in case this ever happens to you, you can check this um, piece on the talon, and again, it was a very easy fix. So let me jump back on the back deck here. We'll get it lowered onto the back deck with the tilt bracket, and I'm going to show you exactly what we had to do to get it taken care of. First thing we have to do to access the internal components is remove this top cap on the on the talon. Very simple to do. Four Phillips head screws right there. I'm going to go ahead and loosen those up, remove them, and that top cap will pop right off. Before we go any further if you guys do find this video helpful please hit that like button and make sure you subscribe for more fishing boating and truck related content once you have that black cap removed you can now see the top of the internal components and where the issue was is right here you can see this brown basically kind of like a cork looking thing i'll put a couple pictures up on the screen so you have a, a better idea a better image of what we're dealing with but inside this cork there's a bar or a pin, whatever you want to call it, that goes straight across. One end goes in a hole over here, one end goes in a hole over here. When you're looking at it, again, I'll try to get a couple pictures on the screen for you to show you the best I can, but when you're looking at it in person, you can't mess it up. You, you, can't, you can't miss it. What happened on for me was one of the pin on the one side over this side actually popped out, and instead of going straight across, the pin was actually popped out of this side, and it was like slanted down going like this instead of straight across so that's what was um, blocking my talon from going down all the way all i did was i took a f um, a flathead screwdriver used it to maneuver that pin i brought it up popped it back in the hole on both sides so it was back in its proper location and then once i had the um the talon extended all the way at that point i made sure i went ahead and cleaned and greased and, and lubricated the talon really well and they're now working you know as good as the the day that I put put them on the boat so to clean and, and, and um, lubricate them all I did was once I had that pin back in place and I was able to then extend the the talon all the way out to its 12 foot all I did was um, I took a little bit of a soapy water solution I just used a little bit of Dawn dish detergent actually just a little bit with some warm water I washed I extended it all the way washed all of the talon of the internal components um, with just a, a, a rag rinsed it off made sure I rinsed it off really good and then I actually dried it really well and then I just took some WD-40 and I lubricated the entire talon with WD-40 I'll make another video showing that process it is very simple but that's all I did so that pin was the issue for me once I put that back in its place cleaned and lubricated the talon everything works perfectly now and uh, I have no further issues all right, so that's how we fixed the issue of the Minn Kota Talon not extending all the way out of the housing. So if you guys found this helpful, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Uh, again, we're approaching 2,000 subscribers really quickly, and I have an awesome giveaway planned for when we hit that 2,000 subscriber mark. So can't thank you guys enough for all the positive feedback, all the support on the channel. I'm loving it. So we'll keep these videos going, all right? So questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. We'll get back at you and get them addressed. And until next time, we'll see you then. Take care.